Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 17.6 Beta 4. It is finally here. And uh, in this video, we are going to talk about what is new on iOS 17.6 Beta 4. Spoiler alert, it is a boring update. But let's still talk about it. What all new things are here? And is it worth updating your device on this update or not? We are going to talk about the iPhone 12 in this video. So yeah, stay till the end and subscribe for more videos like these. Let's get right into this video. So I have installed the iOS 17.6 beta 4 on my iPhone 12. And after installing this update, the number one issue that I had on the previous beta was the battery life. But it is still a bit too early right now for me to talk about the battery life because I just updated my device to this firmware. So yeah, it is too early for me to talk about it as of now but i will be talking about the battery life in depth in my future videos in a day or two i will be coming up with a video where i will be talking about the battery life of ios 17.6 how has it been in my use case so stay tuned for that and subscribe if you haven't already the battery life but in general feels about the same as earlier which is not really the best then talking about the performance the performance on ios 17.6 seems to be pretty okay-ish. I do still see some places where the animations and all glitch sometimes, but it is nothing to worry about that much. If I had to rate the performance compared to previous version, I would give it around 7.5 out of 10. It is not the best. It is not definitely not bad compared to the previous beta, but yeah, it is about the same as earlier. Then talking about the biggest change that is here that is the bug fixes yeah bug fixes are pretty much the only thing which is new here so number one is the wi-fi bug the wi-fi was getting disconnected and the cellular data was getting turned off automatically basically no data for you on the ios 17.6 beta 3 that was a really irritating bug which is now finally fixed so if you guys were having trouble using your iphone on wi-fi and cellular data and your data was just getting disconnected your wi-fi was getting disconnected that issue is now finally resolved on the 17.6 beta 4 then there are some security fixes on this update as well so that is a really good thing the update came at around 500 mbs on my device and after installing this update it freed up around 670 mbs which is actually a really good thing because i own a 64 gig iphone 12 and 64 gigabytes is really low storage so i'm pretty much short on storage all the time that is a really good thing for me so if you are also low on storage and using ios 17.6 this update will free up some storage for you not to forget i won't waste any single second for you guys that are talking about anything because there is nothing new in terms of features so yeah it is a pretty boring update in general the small bug fixes and security updates and uh, the small refinements are here you should also not expect anything from ios 17 anymore because ios 18 is here ios 18 is the ios version that we are going to get a lot of cool new features and changes so look for ios 18 and stop looking for ios 17.6 because it's not gonna give you any new features if you are expecting but not gonna lie it is a pretty small and a pretty neat update in general i don't really had any high expectation before installing this update and after installing this update it led on my expectation and it does not have anything exciting that's pretty much it for today's video thank you so much for watching this video till the end this is me jay aka tech hyped and i am signing off peace out and have a great day everyone make sure to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already